Um, hi, I'm Leticia from Kaboom. Um, you guys spoke about meaningful engagement um, from nonprofit side to the corporate partner. Can you speak a little bit about how, as nonprofits, we can go about, um, we're best known for it, kind of engaging employee volunteerism, but building a relationship with a corporate partner that goes beyond having employees come out and volunteer and engaging perhaps the marketing department to the accounting department and really building a relationship that goes through every avenue of that, of that company so that you can build that long-term partnership instead of that one-time um, event and one-time volunteering opportunity. Um, so I think you'll find that most corporations <coughs> these days are very specific about what areas are important to them and what their key causes and their key um, focus areas are. So the first thing I would encourage you to do is find those corporations that are well aligned. Those are the ones who are going to be willing to engage in the conversation and go deep. Um, so assuming you do that, I think it's part of having um, an ability to talk about your impact and make a difference and then working with them to find ways that they can bring the whole the corporation to do that. So again, you know, find the ones that are aligned with you, find and talk to them about your impact and the difference that you're making and how you can bring their assets easy. I mean, so as easy as unfortunately you can make it, because unfortunately like you, we do a lot with a little, you know, you heard that from some of my colleagues. So the more, and what I will tell you is if the first kind of first kind of tries out the gate or work reasonably well, aren't too painful for us, then that's when you're going to start to see more pieces come in. So I wouldn't, it, it's certainly not an overnight um, activity. This is something that takes the course of, frankly, years to do. You, you're, you're not going to get in the door of a major corporation and have a full partnership from soup to nuts in one year. You're going to start small, you're going to prove yourself, and you're going to kind of keep growing. Certainly, I'm sure there are exceptions to all rules, but generally speaking, you're going to have to demonstrate yourself over a period of time, and then that's where the really deep relationships come in from. Th this sounds very simple. But, but I think it needs to be said. And that is, I think whenever you're having an opportunity to, to meet with a corporation, make that a dialogue. What is it they're trying to accomplish? What is it you're trying to accomplish? And make the match. Don't force a fit. If it's not there, it's not there. And as Emily said, companies will pretty specifically have causes and issues they want to focus on. But, but let's see how we can make the match rather than force the fit. Yeah, I mean, it, it often comes down to relationships. and. And, and, and engagement and conversations and feeling like this is a partner who's going to work with me, who's hearing some of the challenges that we have on our side and what we're trying to help solve, and is there that match? And the other thing is, just from the nonprofit side, we talk about engagement. You might be de defining it two different ways, and you could mm -hmm. be ships passing I I in the night there. Mm -hmm. So figuring out what engagement actually means um, if you're a nonprofit. Um, and talking to a uh, corporation, taking the time to listen to them, figuring it out, figuring out what engagement means to them. You kind of know what it means to you. I think that's going to be key. Mm -hmm. 